Hi, I'm Sean. And I'm Mary. We're at the sharing corner here at the Forks, and we're here to document for educational purposes and um, to hear your stories, comments, concerns, questions you may have possibly, or anything you'd like to share with us in relation to residential schools. And we have an open mic and camera, so please come out and join us here at the Forks. Yes, we'd love to hear what you have to say. Yes. Look forward to seeing you. Well, I'd just like to share uh, some uh, comment on the uh, residential school kids that were picked up and taken away from their homeland and from their reserve and from their place of uh, where they came from. And then now it's happening the same about, about uh, 50 years or so. It's still happening the same with the uh, Child and Family Services. I'm not Aboriginal. But every day in my workplace, I see the consequences of the residential school system and of the ongoing racism in our country towards Aboriginal people. The residential schools may be shut, but the effect of the residential schools lives on in our cities and in our countryside every day. One of the most powerful things that I had learned when I was uh, young was that uh, it wasn't just me, it was, uh, I wasn't just carrying my issues, I was carrying many generational issues and, um, and that cycle of abuse and, and uh, was such a powerful learning for me and so, you know, I've made it sort of my, my personal journey to sort of help, you know, others learn. Well, we need people that care in the system we need uh, caring social workers, we need caring uh, people that come in to, uh, to understand the culture and traditions. And I have been, I've been so struck by the, um, the, 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 the willingness of, of the Aboriginal people we serve to, to forgive those who have perpetrated this, these terrible acts of violence and abuse uh, on them. We need a lot of healing. It's and it needs to continue. And uh, with that, I'll say, uh, is uh, the proper way to say me, which.